Well, I can tell you, inevitably, I get that one half parking spot. <laughs> <laughs> With a placard, stencil it on the pavement for you. <laughs> the Ingalls Center, um, that is included every bit of their old building and their new building? Yes. So that's a hard one to judge, too, because it's yeah, one parcel. Right. And they have, you know, the old building really isn't being occupied right. because their funding was pulled and they weren't able to rehab it like they had planned to rehab it at that time. Uh, so, you know, Ingalls is a hard one. Yeah. I personally think there's probably too many parking spaces. But you don't know when, until they get this I, other, who knows right. when. Mm -hmm. Okay. What would, what would our suspicions be? I mean, does Coles, or just using that as an example, I pass there every day. I mean, would they oppose? I mean, had this been forever ago when they came in? I mean, do, do they like the parking? Do they want the parking spots? I know As restaurants business? like to build extra parking spaces because they want people to drive by and say, ooh, there's empty we parking spaces, right. I yeah. can get in. <laughs> but Coles, I mean. I don't really know the rationale with banks because we are way over parked with banks. <laughs> I have not <laughs> figured that one out, it's like. We require X, and they provide 3X. Almost across the board mm. is what we see. They provide three times the number of parking. And, you know, asphalt isn't cheap, guys. I mean, you know, it's like, that's expensive. So it's like, I don't understand. Uh, plus, Why? most people don't even stop. I know. They do <laughs> on <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. I'm, I will let to, uh, in my prior life, I, I bought a... A, and built a building on uh, Bearden Hill in Kingston Pike, and I had to go before the commission at that point in time, which, in my younger days, and uh, get less parking for it. And then when I wanted to sell that building, I regretted doing that because it was harder. Didn't have enough parking. I was very restrict. I had restricted myself to a particular clientele that they didn't did not need a lot of parking. So uh, when I wanted wow. to sell it and somebody wanted to come in, well, I need twice as many spaces as provided. Well, I, was, I had created a problem for myself. Fortunately, I resolved, but it, it did stick out that I'd made a mistake. So, yeah. No, but I'm, I would think the tendency for a developer would be, well, I'll make his, I've only got X amount of dollars, and we're going to put, if it's only 10, that's what I'm putting in. So. So uh, I could see that happening, but uh, so. Practice hasn't been that way, that's for sure. But yeah. <laughs> well. Mm -hmm. what, how do we I'll be quiet, really. Yeah. I'll be quiet. <laughs> okay, what I'm going to do <laughs> is not change uh, shopping centers and other multiple-use buildings. We will keep our eye on it with regards to as facilities continue to fill. Uh, we are seeing a lot of activity in that respect. We're getting tenant finish outs. Um, but I would recommend that we reduce the parking requirements for large big box. Now, I'm comfortable with 50,000 square feet uh, being the cutoff line, um, if you all are. I would not go below three and a half. You might want to go above three and a half uh, but I would not go below three and a half per thousand is my uh, just with doing the calculations with the pennies and the gander mountain because those are our two biggest I mean those are our two examples really here in town of doing 50 and more four spaces I mean you have it here 4.5 spaces and then four What's the problem? Well, that's for the shopping centers and other multiple use. Go up to the freestanding retail buildings. It's one per, it's four per thousand. Okay, where am I? What is an example oh, of a okay. 50,000 square foot building in this, in this area? No, well, what's on my list here? I got Gander Mountain's like 66. And J.C. Penney is 104. Um, 50.
sized as the Gander Mountain. It's a little, it's a little bit less, so old? it would be closer to 50. The old Ingle Center. The old Ingle, okay. Because they cut off the backside of some of those buildings uh -huh. to accommodate the truck turnaround for the new Ingles.